Tabo Kaveri. I'm grade five, and I'm with, and um, and I finished three levels of robotics course, and I'm very happy to join the IPRC online competition year 2020. My theme is an animal, and this animal is a giraffe. My, I'm going to call my animal and my robot the giraffe bot. Now, please come and join me. Let me show you my robot. show you my giraffe pot. This giraffe pot has four main parts and functions. First we have the head. I made two circles, I brought them and added them. And these two circles represent the eyes. Then I have two tall sticks which represent the ears. Then the head will move left and right. After that, it will move to the center. How is that caused? A servo motor. Then I have the mouth. The mouth is with two parts. For a higher part and lower part. And which one's going to move? The lower part. By a servo motor. Another one. Then I have the tail, which is near the wirings and the other things, which is in the back, of course. It will rotate around, but how will it rotate? By a DC motor. Finally, I have the last function, which is the DC motors, which are the feet. It will move. As I told you, after I did the, uh, the body and put it all of the DC motors and wired it, I programmed it. Then it finally worked. Now I'll show you how it works. Now one goes forward, two goes back, four, which is right, and as you can see, the tail is moving. Then I have as number seven, the mouth when it's hungry. Then I have the head, which is going to go left and right. After that, it goes left and right. So it's, when it moves, sometimes, as you can see, a giraffe looks around for hunting or for food. And this is how it's going to be. When it's hungry, it also moves his head to eat. Now, his mouth. When it's hungry, what will it do? It will open its mouth. And this means it's eating. Then, after I move it forward, Make sure to subscribe and like. Thank you for watching.